I came in as a, um, I wasn't young at the time, I, I, I was a little bit older when I started university and did a, uh, a four-year course as well. So by the time I, I got around to this particular business, it was I was sort of 24, 25, but still very wet behind the ears and didn't have a lot of management experience. And I had I had did the classic mistake of thinking, right, I know all of the methodology, I know all of the uh, uh, the theory behind what should be done. And one of the first jobs that I had, I was managing a team of what we call meat prep guys, um, and it was a, a team of of guys who um, had all been there. They'd been butchers over the years uh, in the days when they would literally bring the pigs in one end and the sausages would come out the other. Mm. Um, but these days they would um, they'd actually mix that uh, the recipes up and bring the spices in and do all the chopping. Highly experienced, uh, you know, really knew what they were doing, and I took it upon myself to see if I could make it make them more productive by amending their shift patterns and amending their breaks, uh, and came up with some great ideas to uh, and said, right, sat them down, said, right, I've got some great ideas as to how we're going to be more productive. You're going to have uh, different breaks and different people are going to go on, on on breaks at different times. And this is what's going to happen, isn't it? Yeah. Uh, I learned a lot about how not to manage change. <laughs> 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 yeah. And they certainly managed me back, shall we say. Uh, yeah. It's a very insightful time for me.